You missed my wife's dope ass outfit. Man, she does like chilling at home well. Mm. Oh, that's good. Appears to be some kind of jackalope. Most likely some satanic brand of beer. We just found out that these people are after me. Run away, run away. Turn it off. We got reports that Catman's back from his hour long shower. Over. He appears to be still sopping wet and have breathing heavily. Over. Love the sounds. Oh, shit. Hey, shh. The bridge collapsed climbing out of here, and um, now it looks like there's smoke coming from the site. What the hell happened to you? It's definitely not the best idea. Yeah, it wasn't me. <sighs> what do we do? Hey. Hey. We ignore it, hey. obviously. If they come to put water on it, then we know the Forest Service is connected somehow. The person who did it is still out there right now, Henry. We're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I, I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. Mm, you look good. How about that bargain? I think I owe you a little something. Hmm? Bargain? Yeah. Receiver just picked something up. Uh, what? What thingy? What now? I found She's a drunk. That picks up frequencies. It's how I found the reports last night, and it's going off now. It just picked up a fre frequency. Yeah. What could it be? I don't know. You gotta find out. All right, I'm on my way now. You know what I just picked up? Uh, no. A fifth of Major Bueno tequila from the creek. Are you drunk? No! I am getting drunk! Good plan. I'm a good planner. My thinking is I could stay up all night worried I'm gonna lose my job well, because of the side fire, or I could yeah. not worry and let the chips fall away. Yeah. Like I'm gonna go check to see what this did. My thinking is Show Catman your outfit. Give me a minute. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. I'll just leave you alone with whatever these thoughts are. Proxy mine, what's up? Need is another big crossword breakthrough. Oh, she stinks. Yeah, that's what I have to do. Oh, what did the hound do? You didn't use your pad? You didn't use your pad? Why is the radio off? I am doing very good, Proxy. We just got home, took a long walk, sold that Super Nintendo I got today, and, uh,. Uh, now I've got some nice beer. I also ordered sushi. So we're doing pretty good. Oops. Is there a path over this way to get down there? Am I heading north? I 
I remember this part. I didn't like it. Ooh, look at the June fire. No, thank you. Maybe I should... Can I take the fire break? Maybe I should go back up the hill. Once I have all the things, I'll smash them. B, I, I found some sort of supply bag, light camping gear, some clothes, and basics, but it was alarmed. I think that's what was making the receiver go haywire. You're okay? It's not a trap or anything? Yeah, I'm fine, but there's, there's also a set of keys here. Now, I don't know why they'd be hidden out here. They say Shoshone National Forest, Cave 452. Who do you think top, Billy? Is that the one in the canyon? Yeah, it is. <sighs> Who the hell took them? And what the hell is in that cave? Okay, okay, let's just think. Says the woman with a half a bottle of tequila in her belly. Maybe they're panicking and we're preparing to beat it. The fire has them spooked and we have new walkie-talkies, so we have the upper hand. Yeah, well, it's hard to feel like you have the upper hand when you're standing in the dark in the middle of the woods. Oh. Well, you're back in your tower. Maybe you need a drink, too. I'm not in my tower. I am looking at a man standing in your lookout. And it's not you? It is not me. Oh my god, go. I'm going. Oh my god! What the fuck? God damn it, no time to waste. I don't want to die here. I'm scaring it away with the flashlight. Yeah! Yeah! I don't see anyone up here. She was just there. I think it might have bugged because I hit the walkie talkie button like as I was uh, looking at the door. Fuck. Pants. Yeah, I just took mine off. Now I'm wearing shorts. Well, this is just fucking great. Let's go back down here.
or I'm dumb. Talking down at the site. It sounds like it was recorded from somewhere nearby. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, and it sounds like we were the ones who burned it down and that it was your idea. No. We are screwed. No. D, just don't freak out, okay? Don't freak out. Oh, my God, what the fuck is happening, Henry? It was probably joggers who did this. It's going to be okay. We haven't done anything wrong. Someone claiming to be Henry in Two Forks called a lookout in another sector early this morning and said that I knew what caused the Wapiti Meadow fire. Um. So, I just got off the horn with that lookout who's wondering what I know, or that I'm an arsonist, or that I'm fucking losing it. Furthermore, I bet you don't have the only tape of us from last night, so someone has evidence to back it up. We need to find out what someone's been keeping in that cave. I'm going down there now. We don't have a lot of time left out here, and if we don't find some fucking answers, when they lift us out of here, it's gonna be in handcuffs. We just, we have to stick together, okay? Keep our story straight. From the first day with those girls to the person breaking in on our conversation, everything. We just, we gotta be honest and consistent. Yeah, I suppose you're right. I know. No, you didn't miss a lot. It jumps, it jumps from like the 38th day to the 60th, so you didn't miss that anything really. Shit is accelerating quickly. Because that person, or whoever's been watching us, you know, it looked like there was a research camp set up to spy on us. Then we talked about burning it down. As soon as I left, it caught on fire, and now there's a cassette. So, I don't know. A cassette saying that we did it. He is a pro stalker, man. He probably learned everything he knows from Catman. Whoa! That's sweet, um, chicken. Congratulations. Trade secrets. Hey, you... You didn't actually make that call, right? To, to the other lookout. It just stuck in my craw. She thinks she heard the door. I'll go check, but if she's wrong...
All right, she was right. The sushi's here. I, I can't imagine how fucked I would be if you'd been lying to me. But now that I asked, I kind of just wish I hadn't. Of course I didn't. No way. They're just they're trying to pit us against each other. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. That's not going to happen though. Thanks, Henry. Maybe I should turn her in. Huh, craw. How much did you get? I got two yam tapura and an avocado roll. <laughs> I guess you're right. Yeah, you're right. I need to go downtown. Use the Gordon Pulaski. I meant Roman. Neozai623. Your name... At first glance, it looks like neo Nazi. No offense. It's freezing in here. Hey, hey, are you there? Yeah, what is it? What did you find? Nothing yet, because someone tried to trap me in there. You saw someone? No, someone slammed the gate behind me and then ran away. I found another way out, but if I hadn't, Jesus! So, so you didn't find anything? No, th there's a spot where someone had sunk an anchor, but the hardware's gone now. I saw a shoe! I don't have any climbing equipment. Well, I just have my ropes. I'm going to hike back to Two Forks and see if I can find anything that could double as an anchor to use in the spot. Well, that doesn't sound dangerous. I never took any pictures last time I played this game, so I'm trying to take them all. Delilah, I just found an outcropping that someone was using as a little fort. I think it was Brian Goodwin. Really? Yeah, he built himself a real castle. He'd hide out here to read comics. The black band, his grief is his enemy's sorrow. Hey, some person's here. How's it going? So he honors them with a black armband, which gives him superpowers. Well, that's fucking dark
bunch of rocks stacked up. You made a wall and a perimeter. God. Yeah, that's, that's perfect. You know, maybe he made it because he was afraid of them. Uh, whenever I think of Brian possibly going through this crap, I get... I get sick to my stomach. Yeah. Uh, sorry. Mmm, sushi. Well, he was in the middle of really sprucing up the joint when they left. It's a little weird that he just leave so much of his stuff out here. Maybe they were in a hurry when they left. Like I said, he wasn't supposed to be out here. Yeah. I, uh, uh, they almost got busted. Brian liked to go out on the railing of the tower and wave at the planes that dump water on fires, and... Uh, I got a call because someone thought a kid was up in two forks. I lied, and just said it was Ned. If I ratted him out, they would have been forced to leave, and... I don't know, I guess I just felt like I was saving him from whatever shitty life Ned was gonna bring him back to. Not that it ended up mattering. Remember that pack I found? Back on your second day? Yeah. I found a plan Brian drew about how he was gonna get it back. You wanna fuck me for sushi? Sure. Okay. It's some wily coyote stuff, I'll tell you that much. So good. Wait, I wanna keep that. Um, Brian was doing a science fair project about bouncing radio waves off of a meteor shower. Poor kid left his homework? Yeah. He must have been pretty smart, huh? Yeah, sharper than a lot of the grown-up knuckleheads I'm used to, yeah. What, you're saying I'm one of those knuckleheads, is that it? I wasn't, but, um, now that I think about it... Because I know lots of stuff. Oh, please, drown me in your surplus of knowledge. I've been waiting all these years for a man as wise as you to take this job. Well, that wait's over, sweetheart. Uh, call me sweetheart again, and you'll use that big sexy brain of yours to fill out your unemployment. That was dark, Bobby. That was dark. Sorry, boss. I found an old school folder. Brian was a hell of a doodler. Vegetarian sushi, my friend. made the place pretty comfy too that's an achievement yeah at the expense of what are probably stolen pillows that little shit There's a busted old toy out here, some sort of electronic game. Yeah? I like Pong. Everybody likes Pong. Gosh, Brian had everything he loved out there. There's a ham radio schematic here, something Brian was working on. Yeah, uh, I think that was the one thing Ned did do with him, you know, tinkering on 
stuff like that. There's also a postcard here from Brian to, I guess, his neighbor. What's it say? That he's with his dad and sorry he can't mow his lawn this summer. Oh, gosh. And also he was worried his dad didn't know when school started. I'd say that's a lucky break if I were him. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Ned didn't really seem like a, you know, with it dad. He also stole his dad's climbing equipment, his anchors. That's convenient. Yeah, it is. I think he was going to hide them in a cash box or something and never got around to it. I mean, he left a note for a ranger to find them and, and send them back to him in Nebraska. Because he hated climbing? Yeah. I mean, it sounds like Ned was pushing him, and pretending to lose his anchors was the easiest way to put a stop to it. <sighs> I hope it worked. God, what an asshole. Yeah. Man, that is the sort of thing that would have caused me to catch a beating growing up. Yeah, well, I wouldn't put it past old Ned. The story is making a lot of sense to me now because I have played. I have. <clears throat> I have played through this. There's some grade A dork character man here. You found his pocket protector. I found a. Uh, I guess a data sheet for one Gladius Silva, half elf, armor seven. Classic wizards and wyverns. If you like Wizards and Wyverns, be sure to turn in Mondays at 5.30 p.m. Eastern as we, uh, we do our own Wizard and Wyverns campaign. The more you know. Charlie Omega, Omega, Kilo, India, Echo. Five. This is Charlie Omega, Omega, Kilo, India, Echo. Three. Do you have any 1020 in your area? Over and out. Negative on the 1020. Uh, Charlie Omega, Omega, Kilo, India, Echo. Five. Uh, however... Uh, affirmative on the sushi, aka the ten twenty twenty. Over. Ten twenty location. Fuck. 1020 is location. <laughs> uh, location is the butt. Over. What do you think is in there? Probably something that will kill me. So, you know, just sort of getting myself right with God or whatever there is. Henry, they closed the door when they could have just bashed your head in with a rock or chopped you up with a. Are you serious with this shit right now? Uh, a hatchet. God, are you sure you want to go back in there? Yeah, especially now that I'm thinking about all the fun ways to be killed. I'm sorry. Look, at least whoever locked you in doesn't know you've gotten out. Hopefully, you find whatever they're hiding in there, and it'll be worth the risk. Uh, 10 for a good buddy, Gunther Wafferberg. Okay. Please keep an eye out on your six for one cat man. He's been drinking um, off colored lemonade all day and taking three hour showers. Those girls turned up. Looks like you didn't kill them. Nobody did. They took some farmer's tractor for a joyride down in Riverton and uh, landed in jail. I wonder if they know anything. If there's some way to ask them about whatever happened at their camp. I think we'd be smart to let sleeping dogs lie. You're probably right. Yeah, I'm going to be playing CS next, actually. This game's just hella relaxing. I was tired after my walk. 
Be advised, Catman's off colored lemonade may or may not be pee over. No. Uh, chicken's got a sandwich over. We're going deep into Catman's lair right now. We've heard that Catman is a subterranean cannibaloid. What the fuck? Smile for the camera, bitch. Okay. Yeah, smile for the camera, kid. Uh, 10:22. We found Gunther's sandwich on the floor of a cave. I repeat, Gunther's sandwich here. Over. How do we react? How do we respond? Ooh. I found Catman's steep shaft. Repeat, found Catman's steep shaft over. It's a pretty big one. Over. Uh, Mrs. Bagel's getting annoyed. Roger, Roger. Yes, you can add me to Steam. Type exclamation point Steam. No, Judy Garland would not have been me. But she, di she died on me. She was taking amphetamines. Opiates are totally different. No, she didn't just take those. Oh. Well, I, I, Judy Garland is becoming more and more of my hero. Because, because she took so many pills every day. I had some Greek yogurt with tiramisu flavor. Tsoof. Gunther. Thank you, Catman. Clock was close. Close, chicken. Very close.
one mechanical injury and we all die over repeat 10-4 good buddy breaker breaker 1-9 this is big papa do you read if I don't use what in the next match did you send me something hey D there you are I've been worrying my ass off hey you um might want to take a seat I've been sitting this entire time. I'm almost always sitting. What's... what's wrong? The only thing in the cave was a body. A body? God, what a mess. Delilah. It's Brian Goodwin. <sighs> Gotta be fucking kidding me. How does that... <clears throat> what? I don't... <sighs> How? Climbing? I think, or made to look like a climbing accident. Mm -hmm. look, I, I think that's just what it was. I mean, he was probably exploring the cave and, and maybe his rope gave out. But whoever locked me in there probably didn't even know about him. I'm sorry, Delilah. I'm so sorry. He'd be alive if I had told someone he was out here. I don't know where he'd be, but I can assure you it would not be rotting at the bottom of that cave. I... There's... there's... there's nothing to say. The hike back. I think we're leaving tomorrow anyway. We're passing through the highway that is called Twitch over. Gunther, I'll check that out after... I'm almost done with this, so I'm gonna switch to CS. Also, what did I want to say? Can somebody please Google and tell me... If it's possible for me and Delilah to end up together, because I don't think it's possible. I think no matter what, it's a fucking sad ending where I live alone, forever alone. You see that plane? Uh, no, I was just busy packing up. Well, there's going to be a lot more. The service says this thing is 2% contained. Well, is this the June fire or the site fire or... The two fires merged into one unmitigated disaster. They're renaming it after my lookout. You about packed up? Shouldn't we talk for a sec, you know, about things? About what? About how all this stuff is connected. The surveillance, the Goodwins, Brian's death. Look, I don't know what to say, okay? It's like, it's like the universe cooked up the cruelest thing to have happen. Does it connect to everything else? I don't know. I don't know if I even want to. Of course you do. There, there's gotta be a reason. Does there? Maybe. Maybe not. I wouldn't even know where to begin. Well, fuck. Uh, for starters, I guess you could- God damn it, Emdahl. Holy crap. Yeah. Uh, oh my god. We don't know what it is. It could be nothing. Yeah, it could also be whoever was listening to us. Who, whoever made the tape. Okay, yeah, um, look, you should pack up everything you need in case we get the call and you can't come back. All right, look, if, if something happens... I'll remember you. Oh, well, that's nice. Yeah, we're definitely going to die. There's a there's an ending where we get where we end up together. How? I've never seen a picture of her. Dala has been frigid lately. Like Mrs. Bagels. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, you can eat more of the sushi, eh? No, that's yours. It's not mine. I'm full. I can make food at home. No, I'm, I'm, I am swear to God, it's going to get wasted if you don't eat it. I'll eat it tomorrow. No, you're not allowed to eat it tomorrow. You have to eat it tonight. Or you're dead. Double E-D dead.
I love you. I love you too. Look what I got. Do you want to see? She might fight me. What do you got? Look. <gasps> Mother Mary. She's beautiful. She's so snuggly. She's a good girl. She should scrub that hound's bottom. What's your status? No, she doesn't need a bath. I think I'm getting close. All right. Well, I just got word that they are coming to get us. My place. You sound worried. No, I'm it's, it's just... Brian? I'll coordinate with the evac team and let you know when to head towards the tram. It's north. Far. Past where you found that cut back in May. There's an emergency tram out there that will let you hike to the rendezvous point at my lookout. Oh, look at Peanut. Pee! Look, she's doing the bear thing. <laughs> I don't know if there is an episode two, is there? They should make another Firewatch, although you can't really make another Firewatch. They should just make another game starring these characters. Maybe it'll be Nightwatch and you're a security guard. You're a security guard at like a pizza place where there's these animatronic robots and they're really scary and they, they come to life and they kill you. Yeah. We'll call it Five, Night at, Five Nights at Henry's. Nice. Which way? North? North it is. They should totally make that game. Night watch. Tony, did that movie Dumbo make you cry? Wow. Dumbo? I never watched Dumbo. But yeah, I probably would have cried if I watched Dumbo. How'd they take the baby away from the mama? Yeah, well, you know, because um, Disney is uh, satanic, it's always about removing the mother, killing the mother, sacrificing the mother. Oops. What is they did the dad? Yeah, sometimes they do the dad. Lion King. Ah, your light. These hounds. We need a little cloudy. Just a little bit of cloudy. Uh, Bambi, yeah. I think it's an original idea, too. Did they? She sounds pretty. Someone left a rope for me to climb up. I'm down near the lake. How do you know it's for you? There's a tracking color tied to it. Someone was leading me here. And there's another tape. Oh my god, Henry. surveillance operation okay what does that mean what is it 
It was Ned Goodwin. He was the one listening to us, just him. Ned Goodwin. He made the tape? Yeah. Cloudy looks very he's gone handsome. Deeper into the Shoshone. He doesn't want anyone to know he's out here. The Because he killed Brian. Because he killed his fucking son. You need to get back here. They say the helicopters are making rounds. Okay. Goodwin was the one who wrote the reports I found at the site. He wrote down everything he did to us. Everything he did every day, he was scared shitless. I lost all the pets. Well, you drove them all away. I what can I say? I didn't do anything. Well, it seems like now you did. Turn this off. You're a monster. You're a beast. I'm cold. <laughs> well. Some of Brian's things. Wizards and wyverns. Yeah, well, I'm sure he found it riveting. Well, these are expensive, so I'm gonna hold on to that. He. God. What? Nothing, just some of Brian's stuff. Brian was a nice looking kid. I'll give that to Delilah. Ooh. Ooh, oh, babe. It's cold. It's not cold. Box looks familiar. From the girls. Yeah. I thought you threw it into the lake. Well, he must have fished it out. You should see some of the stuff he was working on. I guess he had a lot of time on his hands. I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. I don't know what you want me to say. We're in the middle of a fire that is at 22,000 acres and growing fast. It's gonna burn all of this up. Well, take a picture if you're so keen to remember it. You're not? I don't know. What do you do in the winter? He would have needed to seal this door up.
Nice. I was thinking of trying that game. Seems legit. Yeah, I know. Excuse me. He's a good guy. Look, you're in the dark, huh? That's where you belong. You belong in the dark. In the dark. I like how he called me a good guy. I wonder what I did to make him say that. station up here. He was listening to us on that. Okay, well. He had quite the view. It's like, is this where I lost her? Th yes, it is. <laughs> A dark room for dark business. We out. Now where do I go? Your baby account. Aren't we the, aren't we the same league proxy? Alrighty then. Head uh, due west into Thunder Canyon. Uh, his he he eats his um, painkiller flavored yogurt. I'm pretty sure. Wasn't it painkiller flavored yogurt? <laughs> Hydrocodone and Valium flavored. A silver one and two gold Nova three. Well, Lila, I, I think it was an accident. I don't think Ned meant to kill him. We don't know what happened for sure. Ned wanted his son to be able to climb and do the sorts of things he did himself, but Brian couldn't. And how'd that turn out, Henry? I'm sorry. God, it would have been so easy to tell the truth and have him sent home. I can't stop thinking about it. You'll let it go, and it'll be okay. It'll haunt you for a while, but eventually you'll look back and you'll be far enough away to forgive yourself. Justify to myself, maybe. Yeah, well, that's better than nothing. He'll still be down there in that cave. Because if I say anything, they're gonna ask me about Ned. <laughs> D? Oh, fuck. Is that a helicopter? Yeah, hold on. Hey! No, there's one more. Yes, here, yeah. Yeah, he's coming. Okay, uh, one second. Hey, they're here, but they're making rounds. They'll come back. 
Um, I think I'm gonna go with him. Uh, D. What if they don't come back for me? They'll come back. That's their job. Just what if we missed something about uh, something? I don't know. Henry, you're tired. There's nothing big going on. They'll come back for you. Just wait. I'm gonna go. Okay. If you have to. I have to. Hike safe. Oops. Oh well. This will be fine. Fucking Danimals. I always think about Danimals. Fucking Delilah, man. Hey, David. You despise me, don't you? Hell, if I gave you any thought, I probably would. Oh, Retro Reaper. A toast to you, you sweet prince. I'm gonna have a sip of beer on your behalf. Uh... I like chains. I like popcorn. Oh, well, I'm gonna die out here. Oh well. Did you say oh well? Yeah. <laughs> What's it like in fire forests? Warm. Somewhat muggy. Nice smell. But a little oppressive. Your eyes get burny. That's right, baby. Oh well. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> She's fucking funny. I want to ask Emdal how the birthday lunch was. Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes, can I head this way? Due west? Ball sack. I like the music. Oh, I, I don't know. Catman said you were out at a lunch or a birthday lunch or something. I just want to know if you had fun. Or if that was private business. Uh, Catman didn't say anything and I just made it up and it was a lucky guess. Yeah, how was the thingy thingy? Take the long drop down. I'm gonna die out here. Right turn, Clyde. Oh, cheese, M doll. Sick cover up. <laughs> I got your back, dude. No stress. Yeah, that's where I take my wife for her birthday. Where are you taking me? To Hooters. You. <laughs> you. <laughs> Is she going to Niagara Falls? Niagara Falls? Yeah. Maybe we can go this weekend. You should Google prices of hotel rooms. Yeah. We don't have a lot of money, but I wouldn't mind going for the night. Maybe I can gamble. Right turn, Clyde. Psh, this is pickup. We cannot land the LZ. You'll need to run from there to the save point. Repeat, repeat. Cannot land the LZ. Uh, over and out. Recognize we are at a hot LZ. 
uh, Gunther, be prepared to circle back as I clear the LZ, going 0 .0 bearing 2 600 meters past the LZ, I repeat. Gonna take a rickety thing and a fire over and out. Hey, I'm at the evac spot near the ravine. Delilah, are you there? Delilah? She, she ditched me! Yeah, I don't know. I don't have. I don't own my own house, so I don't know if the balloon thing's gonna work. I don't know where Paradise Falls is. We gone, boy. Delilah, cabin. Huh? Anybody? Gunther? Actually, never mind. I don't need. Ooh. This is Delilah's. Delilah's toilet. Ah, I'm a freak. You're vulgy. You're vulgy. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna check that. I am gonna check that, Gunther, as soon as this is the boat done. After I go back and sniff that outhouse a little bit more. Where's the picture she drew of me? I could totally live like this, you know, if I had enough books and shit. Gonna keep that. What we know, white and shorts. <laughs> She left it behind, which means no love. Hello? Is anybody there? Hi. Yeah, it's me. Hey, baby, I love you. The staging area near the trailhead. I think I see your truck. Red, Colorado plates. Yeah. I would love if you could. I would love if you could do a compilation of Mrs. Bagels being savage. Than whatever you drive. What do you drive? A piece of shit. <laughs> well, there you go. Although I think there's a raccoon living in yours. Make sure he's comfy, I guess. Hey, it shouldn't take long for the helicopter to reach you. Okay. There's a debrief in a situation like this. Lots of questions. Ah, shit. So, taking stock, we found out an old lookout killed his only son and decided to become a lonely hermit. Yes. And we prevented one fire? Basically started another. Okay, so that's a wash. Oh, I'll have to figure out what I'm doing every summer from now on that isn't this. You're not coming back? No. And you'll have to... <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Me neither. I don't know what's next. Tell you what, why don't you choose for me and I'll choose for you? <laughs> All right, sure. Um, maybe. Well, I don't think that. I think if I ask for that, I don't get it, so maybe I'll try well, this. You'd make a great shrink. Oh, geek. What's up? Conversationalist, I guess. Thanks. I try. I mean, you definitely still have some stuff to learn at shrink school. Like, a lot of stuff. Noted. So, um, what about me, then? I think you should go to Julia. And then you can figure it out. Maybe put that typewriter to good use. Give me a sexy accent or something if you write about this. I, um... Yeah. You gotta go see her. Would you? Henry, I... <sighs> Look, you came out to put your memories behind you, and they're still right there in front of you. I've, uh... I gotta move on. 
I don't expect you to know what that's like, but I have to find some way to move on. Something to do. What if you can't? Then that's why God invented booze, I guess. Henry. I'm kidding. But I gotta move on. Somehow. I hope you do. There's the helicopter. They'll land you back where you hiked up. Good luck, Henry. You too. Good luck. You keep it for yourself. You need it more than I do. Bye, Hank. I want them to end up together. I hate this fucking game. God! Damn, Gunther. Oh, good night, geek. Good night. I know it's probably late where you are. You need to wake up early. You need a bunch of Belgian waffles. Hey, what do they call Belgian waffles in Belgium? Sorry, Belgium. So just, are they just waffles? Uptime one days? I think you need to maybe die, but not like actually die, just sleep. Ah, of course, Brussels. Oh, Gunther. Gunther! So this will actually get me a copyright strike. What is it? The song. I'll have to block it from you guys. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, I got 8k views. I wish it was more. I'll be excited when I get to the 10k. Have you seen, like, uh, I think uh, One Hand has over 28,000, and uh, Caboose is doing pretty good, too. Look at my pictures. They're pretty uh, corpsey. Hey! Can I put it on him? Why are you touching my business? No, we're not cat panning. Why not? Why no cat cam? No pet cam. Why? Because these animals are awful. I don't, you're not allowed to? Yeah, siesta time. Siesta time. I will post that in chat, um, Gunther. Some nice scenic pictures, eh? How about that one? Woo! Look at that hobbit hole. Poor Henry. He looks sad. Poor Ned. This game is so sad. What a beautiful game. What's the special features? Oh wow, that's cool. Cool. 